Right, we are. They we are, are the firm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. No, you are too. <laughs> We're all the firm. This is the firm right okay. here. Yeah. So this is the firm, and you guys are making this company. All right. What would you say the goal of this company is? Well, I guess the goal of the company is to develop uh, new methods to uh, detect biomarkers. You guys want to expand on that? That's great. Well, That's a great answer. Um, but, <laughs> but we probably should talk about what biomarkers are. Okay. Maybe. Go ahead. Uh, <clears throat> go ahead and explain that. I tried to do that yesterday, but inside Indiana, it didn't go as well, though. <laughs> um, well, all kinds of biological phenomena have molecules associated with them. And um, and so we refer to those as biomarkers or molecular biomarkers. Um, and that ranges from uh, monitoring drugs, both good and bad, to monitoring diseases such as cancer. So there are biomarkers that indicate, or molecular markers that indicate a lot about you. Uh, and that ranges all the way from diet to nutrition to disease. It's basically the diagnostic tool to uh, identify the specific condition of your body. Uh, so if you were exposed, for example, to the drug, or if you have the, the disease like a cancer or a diabetes, so you focus on a specific molecule which is only associated with that exposure or with that disease. Well, the marijuana detection is, we're sort of like a test case for us. It's the thing we, it's the uh, biomarker that we've started with. And uh, we're, we're taking a look at being able to de detect marijuana. There's, um, there's testing devices that are already out there. They're, they're based on metabolites, what we're looking at is the actual intoxicant itself. And um, uh, we feel like if we can do this, we can expand this to, to other biomarkers. Okay. So looking at metabolites for this address? No, it's, it's looking... The presence of the intoxicant the itself, of the THC. THC. Okay. And uh, a lot of uh, situations, say in an occupational situation, you're driving a train or a, you know, a crane or a, a forklift or something like that, you, you know, a lot of employers may not be quite as concerned whether you, you know, smoked pot a week ago, but they want to know if you're, you know, doing a, a dangerous occupation and under the influence. So currently under, currently the, under the influence. Basically, testing like uh, they do, you know, for alcohol right now. You know, um, alcohol tests that are out there only tell you whether you, you know, there is, the, the intoxicant is in your system. And that's what we're trying to do with the THC.